Hey, welcome back to another episode of Snippet Sunday. In today's episode, we'll be going over how you can redirect your users to their intended route during registration. All right, let's get started. So by default, Laravel provides this redirect to property on the register controller, which tells the system where to redirect the user after they've registered. Some people don't know, but you can actually provide a function here instead of the string if you need to do some custom logic. So we can create a protected function called redirect to. And uh, by default, we could just return the same thing, home. And then when, once we have the function here, we don't need the string property anymore. So we'll comment that out. So now, just as our test, we can go to our example application, register as a new user, and we should be redirected to the home route. Cool, so this is the home page. And as an example, again, we can take it one step further. And instead of going to home page, we can be redirected to the slash test route. So we'll register in a second user. And again, we should be going to slash test after we register our, our account. Great. So that's working as intended. Now, the point of this snippet is actually to take this function one step farther and redirect the user to where they intended to go before they got hit by the authorization gate. So we can do that and it looks like this. So we have the redirect to function and instead of just returning a hard coded string, we can actually check the session to see if the URL dot intended property is set. And if that's set, we can redirect there. Otherwise we'll fall back to our normal slash home root. And what Laravel is doing behind the scenes is when you get hit by that off gate and you're not logged in, it's setting URL dot intended as the route you tried to hit. So that's stored on the session. Now we've authenticated or we've registered and that URL intended property is still there in the session. So we can pull it and redirect where we need to go. We have our default set to slash home. We can go back to our example app. We'll log out. And this time we'll try to hit the slash test route while unauthenticated. So that hits us with the auth gate. I'm going to pretend I don't have an account yet. So I'm going to register a new account. My name's Owen. Do another email at alias uh, test3 at gmail.com. Register my account. And if this is working, the URL.intended property should be set. And we should go to slash test instead of slash home. And there we go. So we've registered a new, new account. We've ran our custom redirect to logic. And we've ended up at the slash test route. All right, so that's been episode one of Snippet Sunday. I hope you found this snippet useful. If you did, make sure you follow me on Twitter, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and leave a comment below. Thank you.